so yeah this is the Nahanija problem uh, I'll just quickly jump into the solution like uh, initially he will give you n and this is your key and this is your array elements right this is your array elements now I'll just quickly explain the solution that is okay yeah uh, so uh, he has given you the operation that uh, you need to perform that right you need to perform uh, you can you can see this operations that what you need to apply from here now what you need to from apply you need you can see you can see like uh, if there is an array, uh, array like uh, some one two three four five I can give you any element I can give uh, uh, give you any element except this last element except this last element you can you can if if any element is given as a key from this from this set you can you can print as right if any elements from 0 to n minus 1 if any elements 0 to n minus 1 if they are present as a key in this then you can simply print s else you can print no else you will print no like uh, I'll give you an another example like if there is some two three five nine eight seven uh, four like if I give you uh, as a key uh, eta two eta three eta five eta nine eta eight eta seven it will be yes if if our key is present from the set then our answer is us if it is not from the set then can I say uh, can I say uh, you can you can simply say it as no if your key is the last element and and it is not present anywhere in the before the set then you need to print no then you need to print no simply you need to check 0 to n minus 1 range if your array of i element is equal to equal to your key then you just simply need to print yes but most of the people, most of the people, uh, where they will mistake is, where they will do the mistake is for n equal to 1. For n equal to 1. What they will do, uh, you just need to have the simple observation. Like, if I give you some 9, if I give you the key is already 9, if I already, if I give you the key as also 9, then you need to print yes, then you need to print yes. If the key is given except this element, if the key is given except this first element, then you need to print no. Right? You are, you got it? If there is a single element, then that single element should be equal to your key. It should be equal to your key element. If it is not equal, then you need to print no. Uh, I, I observed that most of the people have mistaken at this case so I think uh, uh, even I too did that same mistake too you can see it got accepted so yeah you can make that 